bad day for finals. A photo remark by Miguel Velasco. It was 11.39 p.m. Josh had forgotten to study. He had a very important final tomorrow. But where to begin studying, he didn't know what to study on. He had a lot of notes and he didn't know what was really important until he found a cheat sheet that he had previously made. He then went to sleep. But oh no, he woke up late. He had to run out the house. He took what was most important for him. He then ran to the bus stop. Anxiously in the bus stop, he then began waiting for the bus. The bus was not arriving at his usual time. But then again came a surprise. The bus. He then headed to Logan Square Blue Line, where he had to catch his train to head to the loop. He ran down the stairs. He then headed into the trains, where he was going to catch his train towards the loop. But the train was not arriving. He knew the train had to hurry. He had a lot of stops ahead of him. The other train kept arriving, but his wasn't. Until surprise, his train did come. He then he then patiently waited in his in his cart until he reached his destination, which was Jackson. The stairs and the elevator were packed. He knew he had to get to class in a rush, but the people were not moving. He then ran into the DePaul Student Center. He had reached his destination, which was DePaul University. He then catched an elevator and reached his destination, which was the 11th floor. He then ran down the hallway. He had to get to the classroom where his test was going to be at. But to his surprise, the doors were locked. He then entered the classroom, but it was already empty. There was one test left, and there was a test that he had to complete. He was late, but he was determined to finish his final. He then finished it and took it to his professor's office. And to a surprise, he passed the class.